we are going to see about the chapter 2 measurements so in a measurement we already studied about the metric units okay that's nothing but length should be in meter weight should be in gram capacity capacity means volume volume should be in liter that's what we are going to see in db so this is a normal tabulation ma'am so therefore they given the length hmm? for the uh, given the before that we are going to see about this this is a normal so so one centimeter mini book on which i will teach okay one one centimeter equal to 10 millimeter so if you're having the scale like this so for example zero one two three four one two three four five okay so like this you're having right so so zero to one this is a one centimeter right so we having a this small lines right that is a millimeter so in between how many we having one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay so zero and uh, this up to this so zero to one how many lines we having ten lines so that is nothing but ten millimeter so one centimeter means that lines ten millimeter okay then um if you having uh one this means one centimeter means 10 millimeter so one meter means uh thousand milli sorry thousand millimeter means one meter okay you should memorize this okay one meter equal to m means meter uh, cm means centimeter km means kilometer okay so one meter equal to how much thousand millimeter so by base this okay this is your base okay so one meter are you clear so normally we are going to buy some products some cloth means in your shop what they given so taking a some meters meter one meter cloth so how many millimeter we having so we having a thousand like this line thousand lines so uh, we having so in your shop they have the that much of the long scale also okay one meter means thousand millimeter one meter means hundred centimeter are you clear this is a thousand means this is a hundred centimeter then one kilometer means thousand meter one kilometer means thousand meter. you should memorize this so weight weight should be in the kilogram or gram so kg means kilogram g means gram mg means milligram okay so one kilogram equal to thousand gram 1 gram equal to 1000 milligram. Volume. Volume is nothing but 1 kiloliter. Volume should be in liter, right? So, 1 kiloliter equal to 1000 liter. Okay. So, 1 liter means 1000 milliliter. You should memorize this tabulation. So, meter is the middle part. Ma. Meter is the middle part. Millimeter is a very small. Okay. Kilometer is a large meter is a middle part millimeter and kilometer so after millimeter is converted to so millimeter is converted to centimeter centimeter is converted to decimeter decimeter is meter so meter to decameter decameter means hectometer that's what they given in this place millimeter so millimeter is 10 times increased means become a centimeter centimeter 10 times increased means decameter means it's sorry decimeter decimeter 10 times is greater means um meter this is a meter okay so that one they mentioned base base means middle okay so uh, meter is uh, 10 more improved means decameter decameter is 10 more improved means hectometer kilogram and sorry hectometer is uh, improved to the 10 means that's a kilometer okay so if you decreased means so 10 divided means hectometer so 10 is a decreasing means hecto uh, decometer decometer is a decreased 10 means base means meter so this also decrease means decimeter this is decrease means centi this is decrease means min milli okay if you having a base is a meter so millimeter centimeter like that you having so you are having a gram in a weight means milligram milligram so centi so you can write in short form mg okay millimeter how can i write m m centimeter I, how can i write cm decimeter the short form is a dm uh, 
meter is a m decameter is d a m dam hectometer short form h m kilometer k m okay so in this place the weight so gram so milligram so m g centigram centigram okay c g and decigram d g gram as it is g decagram da d a g hectogram this is a basic ma sorry hectogram h g and kilogram k g liter liter should be l so milli liter ml centiliter cl deciliter dl liter l then decaliter d a l in short form you write ma deco liter h l small letter h okay kilo liter k l okay this is a short form normal so what uh, what they mentioned determine the metric unit metric unit means what length weight or volume which it is represented the length of your middle finger so length of your middle finger length means what normally how can we measure by using the scale in scale what centimeter you can use the weight of an elephant uh, means a uh, weight of a so how can you weight your body so 1 kilogram right 1 kilo means 1 kg so weight of the ring is also kg the weight of the tablet the tablet should be very light so that should be gram the length of the safety pin the length of the the length of the safety pin how much the length should be 1 cm centime cm right so pin uh, like this so how much it will come 1 cm so cm i can write the height of the building the height how can we measure your height so this much meter i am having so meter the length of a seesaw seesaw means kadal karai okay so how much so road or how can you measure by using the kilometer okay the volume of the cup of coffee that is a milliliter it's a very less right it's a milliliter this is the capacity of the water in the tank so tank means larger so larger means in liter or you clear that's only they give one ma and when a decimal number is multiplied by 10 100 1000 10000 we, we remove the decimal points by one so if you having a 10 means you can remove the point one if you having a decimal number 2 means 1000 me, means 100 means 2 zeros right so two decimal you can move three decimals means three numbers so for example we having a decimal one 10 means one decimal so i can move this point to your right hand side so i can write if you multiply with 10 means 3 4 5 where it is point in this place so i am having a 1 0 so i can move 1.2 next so that's why this point is moved to this place so 3 3459 Point seven two. After putting a point number, should be represent seven two like this. You should pronounce okay. So hundred hundred means two zero. So two two digit I can move. So one zero and two zero. So where I put a point seven point two. So where it is point two right seven point two right the same. So if you having a thousand, so one two three three zero after three zero where it is. So point zero after putting a point, no need to put a zero. So that's why you directly write. So, um, ten thousand. If they give me the ten thousand, how much you are getting? So the point in this place. So one, two, three. Nothing in this place means put a zero. So four. So after putting a zero, so remove that. Are you clear? So like that you are having. So it's a multiplication. Underline this word. It's a multiple. If you are dividing ten hundred thousand or ten thousand, we move the decimal point one two three four place to the left. So, if you are having a multiplication, move to the right side. Right side. 
point if you are doing a division move to the left side so your point should be moved to the in this place so division of 10 means one point is moved to in this place so 64.739 so 100 means division of 100 so one two points so 6.4739 three zeros means three point i can move one two three so it's uh, i'm not having a po uh, numbers right so not having a number mean put a zero so put a point in this place 0 0.6 like that so in this from this place what you can do four zero so one two three okay zero one now one now the same then other than you can go in the panic i don't have the number so put a zero for my convenient so one two three so four zeros right so put a point put a zero that's it so are you clear so if a multiplication means move to the right hand side division means move to the left hand side for your point okay um this uh, this is for your just for your introduction then we will move to the class okay we will move to the exercise problem then we will discuss okay